There we go. There he is. There we go. Not a great one. Well, there's my inshore slam. This feels like a flounder or a red. Oh no! going on everybody back at it out here on the water we are in the kayak got my dad with me today right there say what's up dad <laughs> he's in his old town sportsman autopilot 120 which is a ridiculously awesome kayak but uh he wanted to go to a spot where he wanted to catch some reds and so uh we are back over here at shired island uh just north of swanee south of horseshoe beach a spot that I've had some success with red fishing and stuff and he lives about 30 minutes away from here so hopefully he does well today and uh, we can get on some but we're going to start out <clears throat> trying a little bit of top water we'll of course go to some soft plastics but let's see if we can't make it happen all right y'all we'll see you out there all right just got the gulp shrimp right here just to throw around some of these spots I can get a little bit deeper off this edge right here around these oyster bars see if we can't get something too tight that sheep's head fishing drag i really want to get to a spot that's way over there before this incoming tide starts coming in too much because it's definitely coming in i'm sitting still and the wind's blowing me to my left oh, there we go first fish little flounder little bitty flounder Man, he couldn't but eat about half of the shrimp. Beautiful looking fish though, look at him. <laughs> Barely hooked. Pretty. See ya bud. Throw up into a doormat. Catch you again. Ooh, there we go. Got him. Oh, a little trout. Tiny trout. No. I'll see if there's. It was a trout, but small one. Ooh. Ooh. There's a better fish. That's a better fish right here. Better fish right here. He's swimming at me. This is a better one for sure than that. Ooh, come on. Come on. Stay with me. Stay with me. Oh, it's red. Yeah, all right. Look at this pretty little guy right here. Beautiful little red fish. Slightly blue tail. Oh yeah, he's got a lot of blue in it, if you can see it. A pretty little red fish, man. Awesome little catch. Let's keep it going. There seems to be a concentration of fish right there. All right, bud. I'll see you. All right, that was two bites right here, real quick, back to back. Hopefully there's something right off this point. All right, we moved up about 10 feet. So I think they're just sitting right here on this edge, trying to catch stuff as they pass by on the incoming tide right now. It's got good oysters over there, that's what it is. That's what I caught this fish off of is an oyster bar. Oop tell people all the time having a, a good rod is is key when you're doing this type of fishing because you can feel the difference between a bite and the bottom because a lot of times they can feel pretty similar and it's good to know the difference having a fast action rod or extra fast really helps you to be able to do that oh daggum i've gotten hit three times right here dad Straight out in the open. Yep. 
Oh, crap. Oh, there he is. Oh, there we go. There we go. Got a trout. So it feels like a trout. Ooh, looks like a good trout. Or a better trout, not a great one. Well, there's my inshore slam. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, he fell off right there. All right, so we're gonna say first keeper fish. He's barely over 15, but we're gonna take him. So we want some fish for dinner. So let's get him in the box. All right, let's see if we can't get on another one. One keeper. Just out here, kind of in the middle where this, all this water dumps in with this incoming tide. Tends to be where the fish stack up a lot. Oh, I think I'm already on. Ah, that coming. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. Oh, well, battery just died. <coughs> and uh, caught another 13 inch trout. Dad caught one. <coughs> over there as well it's about 13 or so so there's definitely some fish right up here i'm gonna get to where i can put out the anchor uh i get this battery recharging just got a feeling i'm gonna need them today GoPro start recording. Nice trout. Decent trout, decent trout. Ah, uh, he's not big enough. Nope. But he's a fun guy. Ow, gosh. Okay, oh, don't get on my clothes, dude. I don't want this to rub off. Oh, there we go. Well, <laughs> I didn't want him to rub off all that slime, but something a little trout it's the little guy pretty ah, I'm trying to let you go this feels like a better fit he running oh yeah he, he he'll be a measurer for sure yeah, oh yeah, he's keeper. He's definitely bigger than the last one. Well, I say that. He's not super thick. He's long. How long is he? I don't know. He looks like about 16. That's what I'm thinking. All that fish slime from that last one. He is like 15 and 3 quarter. I'll take him. It's a keeper. Awesome. Number two. All right, let's see if we can't get another one right here. Just bit the head off so we can get some new ground for the things that hold the uh, jig head. Let's see if we can't. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> That's good fish. That's good fish. Oh yeah. This might be the best trout right here yet. He's got him. Going on the offhand side. <laughs> Eight more. You gotta catch yours. <laughs> All right, off the salt and pepper grunt or uh, gulp shrimp. I don't, I don't know if this guy's gonna be a keeper. He he might stretch. I'm gonna guess 14 and a half though. I need to get me one of them boards. It's 15. Yeah. 15 and a half. We'll take it. <clears throat> 
Another one in the box right here. Well, so, since I'm up here. Get it out? Yep. Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, I don't think he's that good. He is a trout. I can feel him shaking. Or he might be a flounder, actually. I bet it is a flounder. Yep. I was going to say it's staying down. Well, I started thinking about the way it bit, too. It was just a boom. Well, there we go. Flounder number two for the day. <laughs> this one's a little bit bigger than my first one. First one was not very big. So that's not saying much. But still, he's a pretty little guy. Hey, 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 hey. We're going to let you go. Look at him. Pretty little guy. Two eyes right there. So cool. Yeah. All right. He gone. This is the bait of, of the day right here. Start the day. Yep. Good. Okay. Yeah, it's a little salt and pepper is what I call it. Yeah. yeah I got this one. I just caught a little one. But... Yeah. Now, I do use New Penny in white out here. Um, and I have good luck with that too. I've caught some good fish off a of new penny. Dad, <laughs> I saw it. Dad just lost a nice one. Could only do so much. Put, come out here, tell him where the spots are, give him the bait. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I could. I'll say I could. I could fish right next to you. Hand you the rod next time if you want me to. <laughs> oh, Dad's got him a trout. He looks like he's a decent sized one. Got a bigger mouth anyway. Yeah. Oh yeah. Don't let him get off. Don't get him slack. Try to get out of your way. The wind's pushing me now. I don't think he's 15, though. He hit like a ton of Ooh. Ooh. Oh, dang it. <clears throat> Die, gummit. Oh, there you go. This feels like a flounder or a red. Oh, no. That was a good fish. I bet it was a flounder, but it was a good fish. Cause he bit it one time and just sat there with it. Thought I was hooked up on bottom. Dang it. Where was that at? Like right out here. It's all right. We'll get another one. Well, I totally missed this catch. Nice little trout right here at the mouth of this creek. He is probably, if I had to guess, it feels like he is about the same. As my other ones is about that 14 and a half range. No idea where my ruler is at. There it is. All right. Feels like he's about 15 and a half. He's fatty though. Oh no, this one's short. He's 14 and a half. He is a chunky one. Look at his belly though. Cool little fish. Let's get him back. Oh, golly. He gone. Man, you can see I've, I've used this <laughs> I've used this gulp as much as I can get <laughs> use out of it so I gotta put me on a new one I just have me a uh, puffer fish there you go take a bunch of chunks out of my out of my bait and I don't have any more salt and pepper ones as far as I know I might have some more in my bag I need to look but Got these on hand. I'm going to use these for a few minutes. If I don't get any bites off of this, I will go back to the gulp shrimp. But this is a salt, or not salt strong, uh, Fish Bites Fight Club, the Hammer Fist, Dirty Boxer. I like these a lot. So we're going to give it a shot. I was just trolling along this Dirty Boxer as I was going. And it looks like a decent trout. 
Decent one, decent one. Ooh. Oh, just came out and made a mess. Well, I really hope you're a keeper now because a lot of effort entailed into this. I don't think this one's gonna make it. All right, we got 14 and a half. Let's release them. Old. old boy, release them. All right, catch them another day. Got an airboat coming by. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. That's a better fish. There we go. bait I could sit there and watch my bait running through the water and he just jumped up and, there he is he's a little bitty flounder it's a little bitty flounder he just jumped jumped up and grabbed it I don't know if he probably saw me now <laughs> that was cool all right going back with the old salt and pepper here see what happens Go, GoPro, start recording. It's a good trout. GoPro, start recording. Little rat red. I told you there's reds up in here. I'd like them to be about twice as big. <laughs> or not twice as big, but maybe half as big as that. That'd be nice. Nice little, nice little red. I'll see you, bud. another red maybe another small one yeah looks like he's getting a little bit bigger yeah he's a little bit bigger he's probably like 17 16 17 we might have to get a picture with this guy because he is so pretty looking awesome little red very cool bright blue tail right there man very cool. We'll see you, bud. Right there. Oh. oh gosh. New. Oh, that feels like a bite. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yes. Another red. Uh, he looks like it's pretty small surfing him. Another rat red. Oh, hey, that's probably the best one of the day. Nah, he's probably 16, 15, 16. Still, he's a fish. He's a fighter. And beautiful fish. It's super blue tail on this one. Goodness gracious. I don't know if y'all can see that. That's super blue. Super cool fish, man. All right, appreciate it, bud. Three spots, one right in the middle, one, two on the tail. Man, he's so blue. Very, very cool. Trying to give y'all a view. I can't tell if y'all can see it. <laughs> <laughs> he's excited. Yep. Now, my goodness. Y'all, 
<laughs> that was the smallest trout I've ever hooked in my life. I mean, that thing, and he had the old shrimp in his mouth. That's what, that's what got me about that one. He probably wasn't but five inches long. I sat there and watched him come up and eat it. Oh, a little flounder. Just threw it up here next to the bank. He's about to get off. Ow. Just like that. All right, good. Little flounder. Got something here. Looks like another maybe flounder. Yep. Just, oh, there he goes. I just caught another one right back there. Yeah. Got him. I don't know what it is. What is it? Hey. Darker red. Alright. Just had to rehook up again because got hooked on an oyster bar and lost one, but little red he looks like he's about 16 17 get a little longer beauty of a fish see you bud Ooh. Ooh. gopro start recording here we go good red good red Ooh, there's lots of spots too this is a keeper Dad! <laughs> yes. Oh gosh, dude. Stay in there, stay in there, stay in there. <laughs> wow. Heck yeah. Look at that thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen spots on her. She's coming home for dinner. Uh, nineteen. Nineteen will work. Huh? Look at this. How long is it? Nineteen. Catch him. Right here. I was sitting. There. I was like, you know, I'll just throw a little bit. Fish around I was like, I'll throw a little bit around here. So I just threw it out in the open, and then I saw some bait move, and then I bump. I was like, oh, <laughs> awesome. That's a good one. This one's got to get a selfie. All right, this one's going in the box. That's my redfish. Good fish right here. Good red. Oh, he's a little red. But he is a red. Knew that I knew there'd be one right there on that oyster bar. Just knew it. Awesome. Come on. Let go. There we go. Awesome little red. Just right here, there's oysters all up underneath. This water right here. It's just bouncing them pretty hard. Got it. Right there. Oh, flounder. No, the flounder. Caught, caught some flounder today. Hey. Ow. Hey. Dude, chill out. Ah. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Don't want you to hurt yourself, bud. Another flounder. Nice. It's been fun. Let's get over here and load it up. All right, we are packed up. Got the kayaks loaded up. Finished off a great day, both of us with three trout and one red. I think dad's were the, he had the two biggest trout and his red was about an inch and a half bigger. 
but it's all good. We had a great time today. Caught a lot of fish. Dad's first spot. He said he get he gave it a, a, a raving review. Shired Island. So a lot of a lot of good fishing territory out here for sure. Um, we had had a good time. But if you're watching at this point, thank you so much for watching. If you wouldn't mind, like and subscribe if you like the content and if you haven't subscribed before. But uh, we'll get back at it soon. But until next time, peace out. And happy Veterans Day to all the veterans. My dad is a veteran, by the way. All right. Thank you.